What's up, babes? Welcome to a new weekly vloggy vlog. <laughs> Welcome to a new weekly vlog. If this is your first time here, my name is Maya. And y'all, um, we are starting the vlog early this week. I am about to do my makeup. I already did a little bit of some bronzer on the eye, a little brow, a little lash. Root. Y'all, I hate when dudes be trying to just like do the most and like rev up their engine. For me, that gives off bad vibes. You hear me? Like, I don't like that. Anyway, off subject. Um, yeah, I just did my eyes a little bit and just a little sum sum. But we're about to go ahead into the closet slash beauty room <laughs> and do our face. Um, because guys, I actually have been trying out a new foundation <laughs> and I absolutely love it. So. Let me try to set you guys up at the right angle. I think I got a face smoother on. Let me take that off too so y'all can see the skin. All right, y'all, so I took my skin smoother off so y'all can see the skin because we are about to try a new foundation. Well, I've been using this foundation for the past couple days and I'm in love, okay? <laughs> Thank you so much to Makeup Forever for sponsoring today's vloggy vlog. <laughs> and I'm gonna be showing you guys the new Makeup Forever HD skin foundation. I'm gonna show you guys a close up of the packaging. Very sleek and cute. Love the brown top. Something that looks really, really cute like sitting on your vanity. You know what I'm saying? It's all about the aesthetics. <laughs> but yeah, I think we all know who Makeup Forever is. If you are living under a rock and you don't know, <laughs> Makeup Forever is pretty much a makeup brand that a lot of different makeup artists and professionals kind of collaborate to come out with the best products so everybody is super familiar with the ultra hd range of you know foundations from makeup forever but this one is a newer formula it is meant to go undetectable on the skin and that's one thing i love the most about this foundation it is medium to full coverage and y'all know i love a good full coverage beat so i'm just gonna go ahead and just put one pump onto the back of my hand then I'm gonna take my brush and just start to apply like towards the middle of my face and kind of go outwards. But you can already see, first of all, the match is perfect. The shade that I have is 4R64. And this foundation does come in 40 different shades. Those are newer shades and some of the existing shades from the Ultra HD foundation. But you already, it's already giving undetectable on the skin. I have been loving a good foundation that really just kind of, like I said, goes undetectable, but something that really is like skin-like, you know? I've been loving just like that natural look. As you can see, as I'm starting to put it on, it is a natural matte finish and it is 24 hour wear. We're gonna be wearing it today and doing a little bit of a wear test <laughs> so that you guys can see just kind of how the foundation acts throughout the day. We have no foundation on this side and we have foundation on this side. It is truly undetectable. Let's zoom in so you guys can kind of see how we are looking the skin. It obviously just evens everything out, but what I love the most is that it just kind of like syncs with my skin and it just creates like the perfect match for me now if you want more coverage you know you go in with another pump and you can go in with like the butt of a sponge and just kind of like go over where you want more coverage and it just easily just starts to build up and gives you the coverage that you need like you see how that sponge just kind of added more coverage you know what i'm saying i like it <laughs> okay so i'm gonna go ahead and go in with another pump and go ahead and add it to the other side of my face and blend it out. I love that a little bit of this goes a long way as well. Like you don't need a whole bunch of foundation for it to spread and give you the coverage that you need. I'm gonna go ahead and add some extra coverage around my mouth and just make sure everything is nicely blended, sis. And yeah, y'all, this is the skin. I'm gonna zoom in one more time so y'all can see up close how the skin is looking with this foundation. For me, it is definitely undetectable. You know, if you want to have on a foundation and you don't want it to look like you got anything on your skin, I feel like this is a really, really good, really good option. I will have a link in the description box to Sephora for you guys to pick up the new Makeup Forever HD Skin Foundation. Thank you again to Makeup Forever for sponsoring today's vloggy vlog. I'm about to go ahead and finish off my makeup. And we ain't got time to do all the extras, so we're just going to go ahead and transition it, so... Full face coming in three, two, one. 
all right full face is done and now we got to get ready sis because we got to go so let's figure out what we're about to wear to this party today so i'm gonna be honest y'all i just i actually don't feel like looking like super duper super duper cute i mean the makeup is on the makeup is done <laughs> and it's giving but i low-key want to just like throw on like a hoodie or something like a jean jacket over it and like some leggings like that's that is really like the vibes that i'm kind of going for for this party because i mean i still want to look cute but i also don't care <laughs> you know what i'm saying like uh, yeah that's the vibes so either way y'all i'm gonna figure that out and then um i'm gonna be right back with y'all you're missing a sock I know. <laughs> all right y'all so we pretty much just put on sweats and um this jacket y'all i think i figured out why my camera keeps falling my leg on my um on my stand is loose mm. Mm. yeah what a shocking surprise but I don't even know the first thing about fixing that. Like making it tighter. Like I don't even know how I would make that tighter. Because every time I put it down it starts to lean to the side. So I got to be super careful. Anyway y'all. I'm just switching out my purse from my Fendi bag to my um, Bottega. <laughs> See? Exactly. Bottega. That's exactly what I'm talking about. Exactly. Oh. Oh this not about to drive me crazy. Oh no. If anyone else has this Sony ZV-1 with the matching um, stand, let me know if yours has gotten like loose over time because that's pretty much what's happened. That stand has gotten loose over time and now it's just falling everywhere. And Maya does not like that. What are you doing, Amira? I have no reason to be in here, but I want to be in here. Why do you want to be in here with me? Because I'm the best. You yeah. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Yeah, totally. I'm the best mommy ever. Okay, yeah. So we just switched everything over to my little we'll take a bag. And let's go look at what we are wearing. Oh, never mind. We're gonna wait until the air goes off because ain't nobody got time for that. Yeah, I'm about to figure that out because this stand is not about to be the death of another camera. Well, it was only the death of the last camera. My other one, I dropped on my own. <laughs> it was before I even got the stand. Uh, okay. Are we stable? I think we're stable. Okay. I'm about to squeeze out. Ah! I hurt my toe. Ah! Ah! I'm about to squeeze out the last of my vanilla woods real quick so I can smell like something. Obviously, it's taking me forever to make it to Sephora. I need to just go ahead and order this online and stop playing around. So, it's ways. Okay, y'all. My loud heat has turned off so now we can look in this mirror soon this will no longer be a problem okay y'all so this is what we're about to wear um this little hoodie which is kind of like a it's a sleeveless but i got this uh jacket over it um i got a bodysuit underneath here just so that i'm layered these savage x um leggings and I'm wearing my nike tennis shoes and my bottega bag and these are the vibes. All right, y'all. I'm about to go drop off Amira, and then we're going to the Super Bowl party. Yay. Even though I'm not going for the Super Bowl because the Rams suck for leaving us. I'm really just going for the food and the commercials. <laughs> All right, y'all. We got Amira to Mommy's. I'm sitting here waiting for Tara to come because she's about to hop in my car. I'm excited to get to this party and chill out a little bit because I am a little... Maya's feeling a little stressed right now. I feel like I just have a lot of things on my mind. And usually when I have so many things on my mind, I'm just like thinking, 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 thinking. And I'm trying to like woosah for a second. I tend to, I don't, I wouldn't say I tend to overthink, but I definitely like, I tend to think a lot. <laughs> Maybe I am an overthinker, child. Who knows? Hi, girl. Sugar. Hi, girl. Hi. Ow. Oh. Oh, no. I just hit my head. You okay? I feel a little dorky, but I'm okay. You're not dorky. Trust me. Hi. <laughs> That's funny. Hilarious. I shall. Let's go. No? 
Well, I didn't go to the door yet. I thought you caught him. I Call who? He knew we coming. But I was, we was waiting for you in the car. Yeah. What's up, stranger? What's up? How you been? Good, how are All you? All right. Good to see you. Right. This is my friend okay. Tara. All right. You know, doing? Sierra. All right. That's Tara, Tara behind her. Hi. How you doing? All right. Thank you for welcoming me to your home. Yes, thank I you. Oh, 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 it's nice in here. We have to take our shoes off. You good. Okay. We good. Yeah. Where y'all downstairs? Yeah. Okay. Oh, this, this, uh, this next TV you got? You said what? Yeah. TV I'm, you know, I'm a YouTuber. Yeah. I'm, I'm to, vlogging. I'm trying to get on, you know. I got you. We have a conversation. <laughs> Hey y'all. Hey family. Hey. Hey. Oh, hello. Oh. Hi. Looking like your daddy. Mm -hmm. <laughs> hello. Yeah, I think so. Oh my goodness. Hello. You're so handsome. <laughs> I don't do makeup no more. No. I don't do it. Because it's a lot. It's a, well, honestly, once I started making money, way more money to just sit in my own house and do my own face. Yeah, and just like packing everything up and dropping my daughter off and doing all of that stuff just for like. $50 to $100 the face. Like, it was just, it started to not make sense. She gonna be in here crip walking. I'm gonna be singing off key just like Mary. <laughs> <laughs> just like Mary. Go see. Go see. Hey, go Mary. Go see. And Amir and I are hyped. You hear me? The new trailer for uh, Doctor Strange came out today during the Super Bowl. And Amir and I just ran through this house. We so excited! Because <laughs> we think it's going to have X-Men in it. Oh my God, I'm so excited. Y'all know me and Amir are huge Marvel fans. So, we excited. <laughs> Alright girl, go watch it. But anyway, y'all, we just got back. Uh, real quick, I wanted to show you guys the makeup and how it lasted throughout the day. I'm going to say we had this on for a good 10 hours, maybe. So I just want to show you guys the makeup real quick and how it looks. I'm already zoomed in a little bit so you guys can kind of see how the makeup has been looking throughout the day. You guys know I did wear this makeup too last week towards the end of the vlog. Obviously, I didn't tell you what foundation it was, but now you know. <laughs> but it looks super flawless throughout the day. I got a lot of compliments or whatever. But I just wanted to show you guys kind of how we're looking um, right here. I did um, yawn pretty hard. <laughs> <laughs> and um I actually got you know a little crease right there from my eyes watering but besides that the skin is looking really really good 
I love I'm loving it I have not pat my face down at all it's been about 10 hours so we have a little bit of oil build up here but it's still very like a demi matte type of finish um minimal creasing in the foundation y'all know I'm really good for having deep smile lines and being at the get together tonight I've been smiling a lot <laughs> <laughs> and I don't have a whole lot of creasing at all. I did blow my nose a couple times, so we're missing a little bit of foundation there for that reason. But besides that, y'all, I would have to say that this is probably going to be my favorite foundation right now. I would say this is my favorite foundation right now. I love it. Like I said at the beginning of filming the vlog today, the link is in the description for y'all to check it out. I'm sleepy. I'm tired. My baby needs to go to bed. So, I'm going to see y'all either tomorrow. I, I'll see y'all tomorrow. Tomorrow's Valentine's Day. I'll see y'all tomorrow. Bye. Silent treatment in your car. Baby, we don't need to talk. Sorry if I'm making this hard. Now I'm just wondering where we are. I'm now blowing out candles because I've had my candles blowing or my candles going and I've been working as a sponsor content due yesterday we did yesterday's video and then um yesterday that took all day <laughs> yesterday <laughs> and then I had some other Instagram content to do today but um yeah I've just been I've been like drowning in work <laughs> And it is almost one o'clock or it's one o'clock right now. I think I'm about to call and order myself some sushi to go and come home and watch Love is Blind. <laughs> I started Love is Blind last night, um, the season, season two. And I want to just watch that until America's home. I got three hours. I got three hours. I think I can at least get one and a half episode in before she gets home. <laughs> but we just got a package what it is mm, what we got what we got what we got 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 what we got what we got what we got 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 so who knows what we got okay benefit thank you benefit but yeah y'all y'all don't know how good god is i now know why the video last week was delayed at this point you've seen wednesday's video and that was the video i was struggling to film last week in last week's vlog and God delayed it because it was literally perfect. It was a perfect video for myjamesallen.com um, sponsorship with the Diamonds Child. I was like, this goes perfectly with elevating your style. You know what I'm saying? So God came through on that one <laughs> because I, you know, y'all know how mad I was when I wasn't able to finish that video. I told myself I was gonna stop carrying this camera all over the place and giving you guys um, a headache. But yeah, y'all know how pissed I was about that video. So I'm really, really happy that it was post postponed so that, you know, we could do that sponsorship because it was just like the perfect integration. You know what I'm saying? So anyways, obviously yesterday was Valentine's Day and it was my plan to do, and don't mind my broke nail child, we are gonna get it 
We're gonna get the nails done a little bit later on this week. I wanted to take myself out on a solo date for Valentine's Day. Um, I wanted to go out to eat and go to the movies, but we are now postponing that because I wanna get it done because yesterday I was just working, 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 working constantly that I didn't even think about Valentine's Day. <laughs> um, but it was a day that I intentionally wanted to like, you know, get back into me and pour into myself and think about, you know, where I've, how I've grown and loving on myself. I wanted to do that on Valentine's Day, but you know, it's just a day. Cause I have not been on a solo day in two weeks and I have just been kind of stressed out um you know getting the stuff with the house um lined up kind of constantly having that on my mind i got a lot of work going on right now which is a blessing and a great thing but i'm just my mind my mind is overloaded <laughs> it's extremely overloaded but um let me pull up this uh this menu for wasabi so i thought about going and you know sitting down and stuff but I really want to come home and lay on the couch and chill so well, we're gonna do a solo date another day that was my plan today I say all that to say child I'll be losing my train of thought child okay I said all that to say that I was gonna do my solo date and stuff today but I thought the sponsorship I had this morning was gonna take a little shorter but it did it took forever <laughs> so <laughs> um I forgot how much content I had to make for that so uh, yeah, y'all, we're gonna go get sushi and that's gonna be, that's gonna be about it. Let me go and call these people. And Amir will kill me if I call and I don't. Sushi bar at St. Charles. Amir will be pissed if I ain't get her no sushi. For instructions in placing an online order, please press one. Mm -mm. For our hours and address, please press two. I just wanna talk to somebody. Speak with a team member. Yeah. Please press three. This is gonna be like $80. <laughs> Sometimes I don't like to answer the phone. Please answer the phone. Please. We're sorry. All of our staff was the other value guests. Come on, man. We're gonna try again in five minutes and let's just hope and pray that we can go and get us some sushi and chill out. <laughs> All right, y'all, we got them to answer the phone. So we about to go get us some sushi. And we are literally, I know my heat is loud per usual, but we are literally like the definition of chill mode today. Super chill. Just got on these leggings, a hoodie, some tennis shoes, my will take a bag, and yeah. We come in right back to the crib anyway. All right, y'all. Let's go. <laughs> okay, bye. Love you. <laughs> Where's my thing? Oh, sorry, I just got off the phone with my mom. So, um, hopefully, they have my sushi ready to go. I just told my mom that my booty looked big in the window. <laughs> Hello, how may I help? Hi, picking up from Maya. Cool. Get it all right here. Okay. I will have to go back and get the eel sauce for you, but otherwise it's all set. Okay, perfect. Cool. You know, a photo shooting? Uh, YouTube video. Yes. <laughs> Alrighty. Thank you so much. You're very welcome. Enjoy your day. We got sushi, y'all. We got sushi. Mission accomplished. <laughs> I just realized that we have not gone and taken pictures in a long time. And I also haven't posted on Instagram in two weeks. That's not impressive. I am very upset at myself about that. But if I'm going to be completely honest with y'all, I have not, the past couple weeks, I have not been feeling comfortable <laughs> um, going out and taking pictures. I've been feeling a little self-conscious, let's say that. I'm forcing myself this week to get out and take some pictures um, and just create some more Instagram content um, since I've kind of been slacking on that. But y'all, I've been doing really, really good with my intake, my food intake, my water intake. Um, and so we're getting this sushi, but like, Everything I've been doing has been on the bar. Who's proud of Maya? I'm proud of Maya. <laughs> um, I'm definitely gonna tear this sushi up though. I'm gonna tear it up. It's about to get tore up from the flow up. Anyways, yes, we gotta get this week. This week, I'm gonna do the things that I said I've been wanting to do that I haven't been doing. 
go to Sephora and get me some perfume. Hopefully they got some. If not, we're gonna order it. Um, go out and take some Instagram photos because, um, yeah, your girl is slacking. We're gonna do those things before the end of the vlog. Mark my words. Mark my words. So I got real greedy and definitely ate a sushi in the car, but it's fine. Yes, baby, it's time to eat. Woo, child, let's go. Good morning, my loves. Uh, happy Wednesday. I am doing my wig right now. And just kind of like, you know, slaying the wig, making it look natural the best I can, child. Because y'all know I ain't no professional. But I try my best. <laughs> I always use my um, Fenty Beauty Pro Filter Foundation in 410. And it's like perfect on my scalp. Just kind of lightly dust it to give it some, you know, natural scalp vibes. I'll just kind of go in between the cracks and stuff. But yeah, I just threw this wig on. I actually was going to do my ponytail, but child, I was trying to... That's what I get for buying like the real cheap ponytails from the beauty supply store. <laughs> and thinking that it's going to give me multiple wears because it never really does. So since I had recently washed my wig, I was like, I might as well go ahead and throw the wig back on. So um, yeah, she's on. I need to tie it down, but I think I'll be okay now tying it down. So I'm about to go and do my makeup we are pretty much gonna be spending the day today guys oh my god maya you probably should wash your face too let's go wash our face but yeah i just realized that i haven't washed my face today yet i got up and i brushed my teeth but i went straight into working out and so i did that um proud of me i worked out today guys I worked out this morning, go Maya, uh, uh, it's your birthday. And then I worked out all the way up until it was time to take Amira to school. Cause I, before I worked out, I, you know, made her breakfast and lunch and stuff like that. So, so I worked out and then I took a shower and <laughs> took Amira to school and then came home and made my breakfast and stuff and forgot to clean my skin, which is terrible, but we're doing it now. So it's fine. And usually in the morning when I'm not doing like a full skincare routine, I just make sure that I'm cleansed really good. And then I make sure I put on my toner and some moisturizer. I'm using this Ofra toner today. Let that dry down. And then I'm going into my Laura Mercier. I've been switching between the Laura Mercier Perfect Cream and the Retro Whip Cream from Drunk Elephant. I love both of these right now. So yeah, gotta get the face nice and moisturized, child. And we are gonna go and do a little bit of some makeup. Okay, I really wanna be out of this house by 11 today. And it is already, I think like 10, 10. I told you guys that I be watching my own vlogs and I've been so busy. The last couple days, I haven't been able to watch it um, since it's been live. That is the weirdest thing ever in it. It's just so freaking weird, but it's it's okay. <laughs> I need to go wash my sponge too before I get started. But yeah, y'all, I'll be watching my own vlogs. So this morning, um, while I was eating my breakfast, I was watching a home tour, and then I um, my vlog came up, and I just started watching that. <laughs> and I was doing that a little more than I should have been doing it but i always wash my sponge on this um hand thing from pract i always use dishwashing soap and i just wash it like that and she's a little wrinkly right now but she's she's working her way back but she's relatively clean <laughs> so y'all do not y'all do not you do not want to see how this um closet is looking i am actually going to be taking off um this friday saturday and sunday to pull myself together because i feel like when i'm moving constantly i constantly got work going on i just am going 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 things start looking crazy in my house and i don't like that because i don't operate well in chaos <laughs> so I feel like I need some time not only just to lay and do absolutely nothing, but I also, um, I need to clean up some things. Um, tomorrow we're going to run some errands and y'all, I really want to get two or three really big like bins because I told you guys that I am about to donate a lot of makeup to my church or we're gonna have like a little event where everyone comes and like chooses things. But also, 
I want to, you know, set things aside for giveaway boxes for you guys because I have so much makeup and I want you guys to have, you know, most of it and I want to get rid of it before I move. I know once I'm back and forth to Atlanta within the ne next couple months, I am gonna like be scrambling and not have time to be like in there and organizing and things like that. So I actually am trying to get a day next week that I can do that organization. I just asked my niece if she can come over and help me out with that, so. But my priority today is y'all just to go and have a solo day. I wanna get one picture, one. Like I'm not trying to, you know, do the most today. Like I'm not wanna do like a whole shoot or anything, but I am gonna get at least one photo today. And um, yeah, and then I also want to get to do my solo day you know it's been a while since i've been able to go out and spend time with myself and valentine's day was just here like we talked about the other day so i have a meeting at two with my managers and then i have to post everything at noon but the video for today is ready to go uploaded you know description boxes built in just everything is ready so that's my priority today i want to look cute get out take one picture and just chillax and eat some food and just chill. I might take my books with me too because I still have not finished that um, Yvonne Ori book. So I might be doing that as well. So I went ahead and skip through the rest of the eyes y'all but we definitely gotta get a new stand because look, y'all see how you're tilting? That was the stand. So I don't think it's my, I don't think it's my fault. <laughs> yeah, I don't think it's my fault that the camera fell last week. I think it was the camera's fault or the stand's fault. So. Ugh, it's very frustrating very very frustrating because i cannot keep spending money on these things you know one of y'all in the comments of last week's vlog was like girl that's a that's a mortgage payment i'm like true that true that um we are wearing our makeup forever again because i legit have been wearing this foundation um constantly and consistently <laughs> ever since i started trying it out last week i cannot lie she is a true banger and i love her i love her oh that's another thing i need to tell my niece because i just texted my niece and told her all the things that i need her to do because i pay her to like be my assistant loki <laughs> what i'm gonna do when i get to atlanta who knows but i need her to come over and wash my brushes and also um take Amira's hair down as well because Amira's getting her hair redone on Sunday so yeah we're just gonna go ahead and do some transitional stuff for this makeup y'all and then we're gonna um pick out an outfit to get, go out and spend some time alone today <laughs> what it is I want to wear but we have the sweating issue for you guys few you a few of you guys <laughs> told me that I shouldn't use pads I should use panty liners for the underarms and we're gonna try that out today because this is a long sleeve shirt and I'm already sweating so I'm just gonna grab a panty liner the, pl the pad clearly didn't stay last time I feel like I might have to double it up or like put two of them next to each other because I felt like, I feel like one is not gonna cover the surface area that I needed to cover. <laughs> yeah, we might have to do two on each side. And then we'll see how this one works out. Cause just the fact that it's not cut and it's like a longer 
surface area you know like longer and it's like in the crease i feel like it'll it'll stay better than i think so we can just kind of see how it goes for the rest of the day before i put on my jewelry i'm going to go ahead and pop on some perfume because a couple of you guys also told me y'all be getting me together okay <laughs> So if you see something that Maya's not doing right or something that I don't know, please let me know in the comments, y'all. I'll be reading my comments and listening to y'all. One of you guys let me know that I need to stop putting on, um, or that I should stop putting on my perfume over my jewelry. Because even gold jewelry or real jewelry, it will mess it up. And I don't want that to happen. So I hope this is not see-through. I hope you can't see this through my clothing. These are not really sticking. How do I get... Maybe I'm just gonna have to buy, what brand is this? And these are always, these are a name brand and they're still not sticking how I want them. I think I'm gonna wear this one today and I always layer it with this Brazilian Crush 71, um, which is like a hair and body spray. But when you layer it on top of this, it gives like the vanilla vibes. I only do it a little bit. Cause the hair and body spray is really alcoholy, you know, it gives that coughing sensation. <laughs> But my dilemma right now is what shoes I'm about to wear with this outfit. Um, I'm not completely sure. Um, I really want to wear my Chanel bag with this outfit just because, um, well, let me just show you guys so you can see what I'm talking about without me actually like talking without context. But yeah, we're wearing this. Um, I don't even remember where I got this bodysuit from, but it's like a cow. Is it called crow's neck, cow's neck? I don't remember. But yeah, um, this top and then these pants that I got from Macy's, which are um, the brand is And Now This. Um, I did a little haul about a month or two ago on uh, the vlog. Trying to figure out what shoes I wanna wear because I wanna wear my white Chanel bag with this. Um, we gonna see. I also would wanna wear my Chanel studs with this, but I just bought some new Chanel studs last night. So they should be arriving probably next week because I have just not been a good steward of my other Chanel studs. Just Let's just say my clumsiness can get it. Everything can get my clumsiness. Like I've had so many crystals fall off of my Chanel earrings that I don't be wanting to wear them for real. This one's not as bad, but I don't know. You can still see it like, and I don't like that. So I'm gonna be more careful with these other ones that I just bought. But I don't know. I don't like that you can see the crystals missing, you know? I don't like that. I don't like that. So I'll just wait for my other ones. I'm going to throw on those diamond earrings from jamesallen.com. And we're going to call it a day with that. Stay. Stay. Yeah, I think we're going to end up going to, um, yeah, those diamonds. That's just gonna have to do today. We're gonna end up going to the mall tomorrow because we need to get our nails done tomorrow too. And I wanna go to Target to get those bins as well. So tomorrow will be more of an errands type of day. Today's more of a chill. Get one piece of work. Well, it's like a work and chill day, I guess. But it's cool. All right, y'all. So the only option of shoes that I have to wear are these. These shoes. I haven't worn these in a while. And it's 60 degrees outside, so I'm cool wearing them. However, I gotta fix my toenails because... Um, Going out with outgrown toenails is not cute. So right now I'm just um, touching up my toes so that they're not looking too crazy. Okay, now I just need to switch everything from this bag to my other bag. I need to make sure I grab a memory card too because there is a high chance that I might run out of space. So I got my other battery too. Oh. Hi, Chanelly. I ain't seen you in a while, girl. What's up? Hi, Chanelly. That's because I'll be trying not to wear this bag. This mug is dirty. She is dirty. You hear me? She dirty. I got to get her clean. I got to get her clean. Where is my memory card? Let's grab it. All right, y'all. This is the final ensemble. It came together cute. I feel like these are the only shoes that were gonna work with this, but it's okay because it is super nice outside and I feel like we'll be fine. We're not gonna be taking take pictures outside. That was my initial thing that I wanted to do, but now we're gonna take it inside because I can hear the wind going nuts outside. So we ain't taking pictures outside. I right, y'all, let's go.
just left the spot. I really wanted to take those pictures over there um, by the wine wall that they have at that restaurant because it's always super, super cute. So I got a chance to do it, but I don't think that the pictures are gonna work out. Something about the light in my pants was doing something weird. I'll throw up the pictures um, on the screen so you guys can see what I'm talking about. But it was just, it was just really weird how the lighting was doing my pants. So I don't know if I'm gonna be able to fix that or not. So those might be a bust, but the ones of me actually sitting down at the table, those might be a winner. Yeah, that was fun. It was nice to just relax for a second. And yeah, y'all, I'm trying to rush home because I have my meeting with my managers in 15 minutes. And I think I can get home in 15 minutes. So let's go. <laughs> also y'all for the record the um penny liner thing did not work out for me i'm sweating bullets job it did not work it didn't work so there is that but you know we'll figure it out we will figure it out so yeah while i was out i posted this week's video and you guys seem to like it the how to how to elevate your style video but yeah i was just so grateful that it worked out that way so i was able to put that sponsorship in that video i'm just so grateful because had that video been out already um i wasn't completely sure how i was going to integrate that sponsorship into a video you know so everything happens for a reason you gotta trust it and roll with it you know what i'm saying <laughs> But anyway, y'all, I'm really happy about that. And I'm happy that everything is doing really good. Because I posted Instagram content, stories, as well as the YouTube video today. Things are good. I, I happy. <laughs> but yeah, after my meeting, um, I'm going to chill out for a little bit. And I think once we pick up Amira, I'm going to do some meal prepping. Because um, I really want to make this cabbage soup. I'm trying to do like a little detox. And then I also want to... Um, cook some chicken and stuff as well and some turkey meat I think I want to make too because I got like the little lettuce but I want to do like the little lettuce bowls with the turkey meat and stuff inside so healthy go Maya I'm proud of myself <laughs> what up y'all so, we are Amira you're really in my bed Amira this stand is broke like big broke okay it's the worst. Okay. Anyway, y'all, we are about to do a little bit of cooking. I want to do the noise you hear is my washing machine, and they're doing the most. Hey, beautiful face. Um, I'm about to cook. Mm. I think I'm gonna make some chicken, like I said earlier, and I think I'm about to make this. Um, I know, mommy didn't fix them yet. They're broken. Mira, this might not be able. To be fixed. That's why I have backup. That's why I was talking about. I think that's to done. Move. I think those are done. I'm sorry. I'm about to make this um, cabbage soup. And way back in the day when I used to, when I used to lose weight, when I had lost a whole bunch of weight, um, I had got this recipe from Black Girls Workout too. It was like this mother daughter duo. And that's how I lost all the weight that I lost uh, almost 10 years ago. I was about to say five years ago. Oh my God, I'm getting old. <laughs> anyway, that's how I lost all of that weight. And so now um, I still like to make it from time to time, especially when I'm getting serious about like making some changes. You know what I'm saying? Back in my day. <laughs> so yeah, I think I'm about to make that. I need to get all of the ingredients out that I need. Can I help? Uh, show. Yay! 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 Yeah, Amira, you are crazy. I am so happy. I've been asking you if I can help about something like this whole entire day. Said no. What? Anyway, y'all, I'm about to get the ingredients out for this. Um, you can actually Google it. The exact one that I make is actually still on Google, and that's where I pulled it from. So yeah. All right, y'all. So pretty much, it's the cabbage soup. So I got cabbage. Um, I have chicken broth and some canned tomatoes right here. Carrots and celery, and then green peppers, onions. And that's pretty much it. So I'm about to go ahead and cut everything up, and then um, and then I'm gonna put it in the pot and let it cook.
morning, my loves. Happy Saturday. The last couple days I have taken off. I told you I was going to take off on Friday. Um, Thursday, what did I say? Friday, Saturday, Sunday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. Good child, I don't know. Anyway, <laughs> we got some stuff going on today. So I figured I might as well turn on the camera. Come on, stay, child. Amira is going to get her braids redone today. My niece came over and took her hair done last night. And then um, we're going to get her braids done after that. Her and I are going to go to the mall. I also want to pick up some more Fenty Butter Drop from Sephora. And then we're going to go to eat. And then we're having a little get together with the people that went to the cabin um, at the top of January. So anyway, I'm about to wear my Ellis Brooklyn Myth Perfume today. These are the vibes. Even though I'm about to be sitting for hours washing Amira get her hair done. But, you know, it's cool. <laughs> today I felt like being just... Amira, you're almost ready. Are you in here waiting for me? Come on, put your shoes on. It's time to go. We already um, starting late, so I want to hurry up and go. Um, we're super chill today, y'all. I'm just wearing all black. I'm going to wear my flat boots, and I got on my um, my coat because it's like 20-something degrees outside, so it's, it's cold. But I think I'm just going to keep this on all day. So, yeah, it's just my um, turtleneck and some black leggings from uh, Naked Wardrobe, this coat over top, and some flat boots. So You ready, sis? Oh. All right, it is time to go. It is. Yeah, y'all, my house is a mess right now. So, ooh, please, sis, don't judge me, okay? Don't judge me. Don't judge me. All right, y'all, I'll probably do a little montage of Amira's hair while she's getting it done. And then I'll talk to y'all after we're done getting her hair done. So Amira's done getting her hair done. It looks so pretty. Why does it look like it's light outside? Um, I don't know. It's the lighting. It's from this this street light right here. Yeah. Anyway, y'all, we were about to go to the mall, but that didn't work out because her hair took a little bit longer than I thought it was going to take. And it is now 6.42, and we got to be at Devon's at 7. So we're waiting for McDonald's to bring us some food. Why can't I go to Devon's? What are you guys doing? Amira, that is for adults. Oh. I thought it was just like random you guys just watching the movie. No, it's not just us. It's, it's a whole group of us. Bryce, it's for Bryce's birthday. I'm going to say happy birthday. I will. <laughs> but anyway, uh, we're waiting for her food and we're going to drop her off at Mommy's. And then we're going to head over to Devin's house. We literally have been at Tara since what, 10? Yeah, 10. So 11, 12, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. 8 hours? 8 hours? It took 8 hours. But because Tara also has to like, you know, wash Amira's hair and that you know, took two hours. it took 2 hours just to even start hands. braiding because her hair is so thick. So, anyways, y'all. It's fine. We didn't make it to the mall. It's fine. But we're doing this tomorrow, fine. so you're going to see it on the next vlog. Right. <laughs> we're going to go tomorrow. <laughs> we're going to go and get it tomorrow and hopefully we can get everything that we're looking for. Because we wanted to go out to eat and everything and, you know, time just got away from us today. So, it's fine. Why did my hair look more brown than usual? Your hair looks more brown than usual? Why um, do you feel that when way? I, was, I think it's because I was really close to it. Yeah. It just looked really brown well it looks beautiful i love it tara made him a little bit smaller this time too and she, she said that was an accident it was an accident like, I but know. i mean she had to just keep going yeah mm -hmm. that's why it took a little longer anyway y'all um i wish they would come on it looked all nice in there Mary, have you been inside no Dan mcdonald's no never i would never step foot why not everything's broken <laughs> Amira says she'll never step foot in that McDonald's. Amira, you're very funny. You're very funny. This foundation looks really good. I know they're taking forever. And look, they got their milk. That look like a shake. Oh, never mind. That's an iced coffee. I was about to say, that look like a shake to me. They definitely told us their shake machine was broke. Boy, I'll tell you about McDonald's. Why are they eating them? Why is they taking this so long just to get... Hi. 
Can I can I get your receipt, please? Uh, yeah. I don't know what I did with it. Y'all don't remember what y'all what I ordered? We all over the place right now. I'm That's trying not to figure it. out where. All we had was a plain cheeseburger and some fries. Um, uh, you know what? I got it. Okay. Thank you. They always all over the. What? See, this is why we don't. Like, this is why we don't come to this McDonald's. That's why I said I'll never step foot in that McDonald's. This has never happened to me. Come here. This is crazy. The chairs is unstable. <laughs> I'm here to say the chair is unstable. I don't even remember what I did with my receipt. The table be moving. Is this it? This is it right here. This is ridiculous. It's all. Can I see your receipt? Her. He what? doesn't even look like he worked there. Like, where is his name tag? Thank you. What? You look like a, <laughs> a person off the street. <laughs> what is happening? <laughs> got to pee. No, no, we got to go to the bathroom. <laughs> it's dark outside. Oh, Lord, help us. <laughs> If Eddie McDonald's was gonna get taken down, this one should have been taken down. <laughs> Not that other one, right? <laughs> if any McDonald's was gonna get shut down, it should have been this one. <laughs> we all over the place. It's not even that packed. Exactly. No one's here. Exactly. I mean, there's nobody inside, <laughs> and there's no line. They probably not even doing their work. <laughs> they in there chilling. <laughs> These teenagers. Y'all, this is ridiculous. This better be our stuff. It better not be for somebody else. Okay, this is it. Here. <laughs> okay, thank you so much. No problem. Let me have them fries. My cheeseburger better be plain. <laughs> <laughs> I love you very much. Uh, who's Goodbye. What? Nana's in the living room. She's coming to open the door. You leaving me? Yes, I gotta go. I'm late. Go ahead. Just start grabbing stuff. There she is. <laughs> Hi, mommy. Hi, mommy. Bye, baby. Hey, bye. Love you. See you later on tonight. So, yeah, we're about to go in here and have some fun for Bryce's birthday. Bryce is uh, Devin's fiance. So, um, I have my roller from Kayali. Y'all don't mind. Look at me dropping stuff. Don't mind my nails. We have been unable to get the nails done yet, but we're going to do that next week. But I'm using my Kayali roller, and I'm using the vanilla side. And I'm just I just put it, like all over to freshen up since y'all know I've been at the shop all day. But yeah, y'all, let's go in and have some fun. Yo. Happy birthday. <laughs> Yo. I forgot you was coming. You looking so handsome. What a blood. Look at him, look at all this. Brother in the house. You remember me from the cabin? Right. I had Girl. My stomach is killing me. My stomach is killing me. I lost my phone too, so don't know where that is. You seen it? Okay. Devin, this house clean, girl. The kids ain't here, that's why. Look at my nails. I had to cut them all off. I could have went and gotten them yesterday, but I was like, you know, I'm going to just lay down. 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 And I binge watched like three, uh, two movies in in a in a show last night. I did not catch up on Love Is Blind yet. I watched You did uh, the new ones. Yeah. I watched um, that show. What's it called? Uh, the girl before on HBO Max. Oh. Yeah. Did you see that? Did you finish? I finished it. Yeah. It was good. Did you think that that was gonna be the end? No, I was surprised. Did you, were you surprised? I was, but I was like, no. It's a thriller. It wasn't hunted. It wasn't hunted, though. Yeah. I was trying to explain this to Tara without telling her to show. If I was looking and they would have gave me those rules, I would have said no then. Oh, yeah. I wouldn't have moved up in there with those rules. Oh, it comes with all these rules and all this stuff. No. Then I watched this show, this movie on Amazon Prime called A Needle in a Time Stack. Oh. Did you see that? It was really good. I told Tara about it. She needs to watch that. That was cool. y'all so 
so uh, we just got back from uh, Devin's and I just went and picked up a mirror and we just got back to the crib but um today was super fun and now I'm about to take my makeup off and take my butt to bed because I'm tired but <laughs> there's something I went through this week that God just really showed up for me and I just wanted to hop on the vlog and just put it out there <laughs> I just felt the need to share that number one you can go to God with any and everything. I was facing something this week and I needed clarity. And I prayed and I was like, Lord, give me clarity. Let me know if this is for me. If not, help me not to waste my time. Help me to move on. And when I tell you he showed up the next day without fail, and it was extremely clear to me. It just was extremely clear to me, like, what he was trying to tell me and what the decision was and the clarity that I needed. It was so clear. And I was just really grateful. And then he started to really drive into me that I need to wait on him for everything. <laughs> and I just wanted to jump on here just in case someone needed some extra encouragement or felt like they... Um, are struggling with waiting on something for their life that you really like desire and that you feel like you deserve you know because I feel like God has been that has been my message for the week God is like wait on me I got you and it's a lot easier said than done to just trust and wait <laughs> especially when you want something really bad so I'm saying all this without being extremely specific to what I'm talking about but um I just wanted to throw it in there um for anyone who feels like you know you tired because I'm tired of some things. But I'm also extremely grateful for a lot of things as well. But, you know, I'm waiting on God. I know he has something in store for me. And I'm not going to let anything get in the way of that. So that's just a little quick thing. I just I just felt the need to say that while I was driving. I was like, I just felt like God was pushing me to say that for somebody. So anyway, y'all, I had a great time tonight. I hope you guys enjoyed this week's vloggy vlog. And I will see you guys on the next